Adoption Day in Kent County works to celebrate new family members and make it as fun and festive as possible. It may just be the happiest day in court. Judge Patricia Gardner presided over 11-year-old Adeline Friedley Harrison's adoption. It was happy, but it was also kind of like, uh, like nervous, like I was nervous, so, and everybody else was crying, but I didn't want to cry. Adeline's adoptive parents, Anne and Adam, who've been fostering her, say deciding to make the adoption official was easy. Ever since I was about eight, I knew I wanted to adopt, so it's just been a long time coming. And she was my dream. I know I was. <laughs> She's pretty great, so I'm glad to have her as part of our life. With family and friends watching in the courtroom, Ann and Adam were grateful so many people could be a part of the special day. We actually were able to get this adoption up closer uh, to happen sooner because I was diagnosed with stomach cancer, so we wanted to we wanted to make sure it happened in time in case something happened to me if it got stretched out and they were able to do what they had to do and they got it pushed up. The Friedleys say Adeline has been an amazing addition to their lives. There's a quote from a movie I really like. It says, there's so many arguments against bringing a child into this world. But how can you argue against loving one that's already here? For a family who understands how precious life is, they encourage others to consider adoption and become foster parents. It's worth it because there's a lot of kids out there that really could use a forever home and a, and a family. In Grand Rapids, Kyle Mitchell, News 8.